YouTube, YouTube, guess what guys? I have won a award, okay? This is a special award. I have to attend a black tie event to accept my reward. I think I'm gonna have to do a speech. This event will be recorded on my vlog channel. If you guys want to stay in tune with this whole event, uh, make sure you guys go subscribe to my vlog channel, Wavy Kid Vlog. This is a big thing for my city. They do it every year. I'm very thankful to have won this award. I won a special award. I did not win a regular one. Mine has to be presented by Dennis Wilson Jr. himself, okay? Okay, so with that being said, hope you guys stay tuned. I appreciate you guys for all the support over these years. It's your boy Wavy KK. Let's get into the video right now. You guys are about to see a little bit of the behind the scenes of them getting a video before presenting me and my award. Let's get it. You're the lucky guy who got the yeah, special man, award. I, so. I didn't even know. I thought I was getting like some type of basic award. And he told me because I cut Rob's hair. Right. So Rob was telling me, he was like, yeah, um, I think you have to do a speech too. I was like, a speech? I was like, why? <laughs> he was like, because the, the award you're getting is special. And I was like, wait, what? What? And then right. I see him on a flyer, everybody up here, and then I'm uh -huh. down here with the bottom row. I'm like, right. oh, it's not crazy. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be like that. Nice. And uh, tell me about being uh, a barber and YouTuber. Like, you know, what's it like kind of juggling, uh, juggling the two of those? Being a barber and a YouTuber, balancing out, it's kind of hard and easy at the same time. To somebody else that don't know how it is, it's going to be hard. But for me, it's kind of easy because it's just, just my life. I've gotten used to it. I've kind of adapted to it all. Balancing it, it's kind of easy now. You know what I'm saying? I cut hair all day and I edit all night. You know what I'm saying? So I kind of schedule. I just cut hair. I work. I record as many cuts as I need to. You know what I'm saying? I think about my content when I get off. Then I go edit. And then I post it the next day, whether it's on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, whatever the case may be. YouTube, what's going on, man? It's your boy Wavy Kid Kev back with another banger, okay? Now, this one, I done transformed my man whole image. This is not gonna look like the same person that you guys just seen, okay? This is all fact. So, the first thing I did was take my two clothes just to see if he had any cowlicks. Plus, I wanted to get a good thumbnail. Um, then, I'm gonna use my two open to cut with the grain, get all that hair down so he can get a nice, clean, even cut. Um, I did his hair was a little bit wet. I think he was sweating or he was or I think it was snow outside or something like that And it got in his hair. So we did blow dry it. Okay, so we do we just basically doing a basic taper So I'm doing my ball guideline right now Just setting it in with a straight line nothing crazy using my gamma shavers These gents come in clutch. They're real tiny compact. You can pick them up use them real quick and go on Use my lever open on the masters. I know y'all gonna be like, hey, but I thought you ain't like the master. Listen, it's a, it's a, it's not a bad clipper. I just don't like the overall shape and how they cut. But I can get a cut done quicker with them. That's why I still use them. So I use my one guard open. Now with the two guard open, just debulking at the top. I'm gonna end up closing that lever. I'm doing every every step that I do for the taper, I am doing on the beard, okay? So just repeat the steps on the beard. Now I'm using my one open with the corner just to blend out that two open and then the two closed area into the one. Make sure you guys are paying attention with these guidelines. You do not want to get lost. That's why I say keep your guidelines neat as possible. Now I have my zero guard knocking out that middle guideline. Like I said, every step I do to the taper, I am doing to the beard. Now I'm doing a lever open, just cleaning up the middle guide line. I'm going to close that lever and take out the bottom line. Same steps apply to the beard. Just doing a little bit of detail work with this and this master before I switch clippers. So now to get a different perspective, I just switch clippers just to detail my taper, make it look blurry as possible. Um, just kind of refresh my mind with a different blade, different engine, you know what I'm saying? Just to get a different perspective when detailing. 
Then I'm doing the back, just doing the same exact steps. Lever open, one open, two open, then the two closed, one open again using my corners. Zero guard closed. Detail work, take out that bottom line with the lever closed. A little bit more detail work with another clipper. And that's it for the back taper. So yeah, man, let me talk to you guys about this little award, man. This award ceremony that I have to attend, it's a big thing for me. And um, it's a big thing that they do for my city every year. So I'm going to definitely vlog for you guys. You guys have to subscribe to the vlog channel if you want to see it, if you want to stay up to date or stay in tune with it. All the behind the scenes will be on that channel. That's more of my personal life, everything that I got going on. Um, I might include the important clips in front of my tutorials from here and there. But listen, man, it's so much going on in my life right now. I just can't thank God more um, for everything that he's giving me right now, the blessings that I've been receiving, um, all of the business opportunities I've been getting with other brands. Listen, bro, it's a lot, man. I, and it still hasn't hit me yet. Um, even with just collaborating with 360 and all the YouTubers and everybody that look up, looks up to me, I appreciate all of that, man. I do not take it for granted, you know what I'm saying? So thank God for everything that's given me. I'm definitely going to use him and I'm going to appreciate him and use him in everything that I do. So the first thing I did was the one guard closed to um, lower down that front lineup. My guy does have a widow's peak, so we're going to cut that off after I apply the hairspray, blow dry it. And this lineup is going to come out super crispy, bro. I'm not going to lie to y'all. This is going to be a crispy, clean cut, man. I feel like this cut can go up against any other YouTuber that cut Cora's hair. You know what I'm saying? Shots fired. Shots fired, man. Take it how you want it, man. <laughs> Take it how you want it, man. Any any other YouTuber that cut Cora's hair, line me up with them, man. I, I want it. I want the smoke, man. Cora's hair, smoke, crispy lineup, blended taper, okay? Line me up, man. Take it how you want it. Like, man, call, call out any YouTuber you know that's good with coarse hair. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and put me next to them, all right? It is what it is. <laughs> but yeah, man, this cut came out clean. Um, we are going to use enhancements per client's request. He also did request the heart. I asked him, did he want it broken or did he want it just like a regular heart? He said he wanted it broken. So that's what we're going to do. And man, these cocoa trimmers, if you guys have not picked them up, please go cop. I do not have a code with them. I'm not getting paid to say any of this, okay? Go get the cocoa trimmers if you guys want to have a nice hitting trimmer that does not break the skin at all. I use them on my kids that I cut. I use them on grown people. I use them on older people. Listen, them, tr them trimmers are the truth, okay? Trust me, I'm not going to lie to y'all. I'm not getting paid to say any of this. I'm just putting y'all on game, you know what I'm saying? Right now, I'm using my Tune45. No drip. You guys can get that at Tune45.com. I do have a discount code, WavyKid. Link is in the description if you guys want to go cop. Shout out to them, man. They always showing me love. Right now, I'm just detailing this lineup. That's already crispy. We just going to get it even more crispier. So now it's time for the beard. I did spray hairspray on the beard. Just a little bit, man, just to get that crispy lineup. And I'm using my razor, making, making sure I stretch the skin and cleaning up every hair possible that's on his face, just to make sure um, we don't leave any hair and that beard looks as clean as possible. So we're gonna dust it off and come back again with the razor line, just to make sure that line is in there, it's set, and everything is gonna be how you want it to be before we enhance it. So now we're enhancing it. Um, like I said, this is per client's request. I didn't want to fill that light spot in towards his mustache because I didn't want it to look super fake, but I do like the enhanced look and so does my client. So we want to make sure that people can see that the enhancement is there, but not too much to where it looks like I just beijing his whole face. You know what I'm saying? So I'm doing the razor on the other side of his face too. Just getting a sharp, crispy line, crispy as possible. I'm also using my Crispy Lines razor. You guys can go cop that. Crispy Lines on Instagram. Hit them up. They don't cost a lot. High quality. 
And uh, these are the only razor blades that I used. So after the cut was done, um, he did remind me uh, he still wanted the heart. So I asked him, do you want a heart or a broken heart? And he said, broken heart. You know what I'm saying? Somebody broke this man's heart. <laughs> now nah, I'm just playing, man. But that's what he wanted. So that's what we gave him. Y'all can see it's clearly clean, man. It's clean. Like I said in the video before, last time I did the broken heart, man, I like to do it a little bit like off. I don't want it to be a perfect heart because it's broken. So I give it like a little off shape on one side. But yeah, man, this is the cut, man. Let me know what you guys think. This is the before the heart. It's about to show after the heart. This cut is crispy clean. Like I said, man, line me up with whoever. When it come to coarse hair, I ain't that raw with straight hair yet. I'm going to get there. But when it come to coarse hair, line me up, okay? Put me with any YouTuber. I'm up. I'm not cocky. I'm not at all. You know what I'm saying? But listen, I just feel like it's that time. Coarse hair. Line me up. Your boy, baby, kick Kev. I'm out. Deuces. <laughs>